e noun the name of the latin script letter e agrees verb to harmonize in opinion statement or action to be in unison or concord to be or become united or consistent to concur brainstorming verb to investigate something or solve a problem using brainstorming noun a method of problem solving in which members of a group contribute ideas spontaneously. Creation. Noun. Something created such as an invention or artwork. Assistance. Noun. Aid. Help. The act or result of assisting. Algorithm. Noun. A collection of ordered steps that solve a mathematical problem. A precise step-by-step -step plan for a computational procedure that possibly begins with an input value and yields an output value in a finite number of steps. Majority. Noun. More than half, 50% of some group. County. Noun. The land ruled by a count or a countess. Adjective. Characteristic of a county family. Representative of the gentry or aristocracy of a county meters noun always meter a device that measures things verb to measure with a metering device cleans noun removal of dirt verb to remove dirt from a place or object finished verb to complete something adjective processed or perfected celebrated verb to extol or honor in a solemn manner adjective famous or widely praised depth noun the vertical distance below a surface the degree to which something is deep implement noun a tool or instrument for working with authorize verb to grant someone the permission or power necessary to do something estate noun the collective property and liabilities of someone especially a deceased person verb to give an estate to adjective jewelry previously owned secondhand learned adjective having much learning knowledgeable erudite highly educated cure noun a method device or medication that restores good health far adjective distant remote in space adverb to from or over a great distance in space time or other extent labels noun a small ticket or sign giving information about something to which it is attached or intended to be attached verb to put a label a ticket or sign on something also adverb focus in addition besides as well further to neighbor noun a person living on adjacent or nearby land a person situated adjacently or nearby. Anything. Of the same type of thing as the subject. In an adjacent or nearby position. Verb. To be adjacent to. Ever. Adjective. Occurring at any time. Occurring even but once during a time span. Adverb. Always. Frequently. Forever. Candles. Noun. A light source consisting of a wick embedded in a solid flammable substance such as wax tallow or paraffin verb to observe the growth of an embryo inside an egg using a bright light source eventually adverb in the end at some later time especially after a long time a series of problems struggles delays or setbacks news noun new information of interest verb to report to make known. Characterized. Verb. To depict someone or something a particular way, often negative. Cooperation. Noun. Usually uncountable. The act of cooperating. Defeat. Verb. To overcome in battle or contest. Excessive. Adjective. Exceeding the usual bounds of something. Extravagant. Immoderate. Issue. Noun. The action or an instance of flowing or coming out. An outflow. Particularly. Verb. To flow out. To proceed from. To come out or from. League. Noun. A group or association of cooperating members.
verb to form an association to unite in a league or confederacy to combine for mutual support noun a version of rugby football played between two teams of 13 cooking verb to prepare food for eating by heating it often by combining it with other ingredients verb to make the noise of the cuckoo verb to throw noun the process of preparing food by using heat adjective in progress happening memory noun the ability of the brain to record information or impressions with the facility of recalling them later it will heroes noun somebody who possesses great bravery and carries out extraordinary or noble deeds lake noun a small stream of running water a channel for water a drain hierarchy noun a body of authoritative officials organized in nested ranks bite noun the act of biting verb to cut into something by clamping the teeth lyricist noun a person who writes the lyrics of a song medicine noun a substance which specifically promotes healing when ingested or consumed in some way verb to treat with medicine baked verb with person as subject to cook something in an oven adjective that has been cooked by baking coded verb to write software programs verb of a patient to suffer a sudden medical emergency a code blue such as cardiac arrest adjective encoded written in code or cipher ghosts noun the spirit the soul of man verb to haunt to appear to in the form of an apparition lecturer noun a person who gives lectures especially as a profession addressable adjective able to be addressed boxer noun a participant fighter in a boxing match blame noun censure insecure adjective not secure hearing verb stative to perceive sounds through the ear noun the sense used to perceive sound adjective able to hear fell noun a cutting down of timber verb to make something fall especially to chop down a tree activism noun the practice of using action to achieve a result such as political demonstration or a strike in support of or in opposition to an issue factor noun a doer maker a person who does things for another person or organization verb to find all the factors of a number or other mathematical object the objects that divide it evenly botanical noun something derived from a botanical especially herbal source adjective of or pertaining to botany relating to the study of plants foul adjective covered with or containing unclean matter dirty deck noun any raised flat surface that can be walked on a balcony a porch a raised patio a flat rooftop verb to furnish with a deck as a vessel logged verb to cut trees into logs verb to make to add an entry or more in a log or log book verb to move to and fro to rock drops noun a small quantity of liquid just large enough to hold its own round shape via surface tension especially one that falls from a source of liquid verb to fall in droplets of a liquid ink noun a pigment or dye based fluid used for writing printing etc verb to apply ink to to cover or smear with ink mad verb to be or become mad adjective insane crazy mentally deranged adverb intensifier to a large degree extremely exceedingly very unbelievably celebration noun the formal performance of a solemn rite such as christian sacrament minimum noun the lowest limit adjective to the lowest degree agreement 
noun, an understanding between entities to follow a specific course of conduct. Conflict. Noun. A clash or disagreement, often violent, between two or more opposing groups or individuals. Verb. To be at odds. With. To disagree or be incompatible. Days. Noun. Any period of 24 hours. Verb. To spend a day. In a place. Noun. A particular time or period of vague extent. Forest. Noun. A dense uncultivated tract of trees and undergrowth. Larger than woods. Verb. To cover an area with trees. Creates. Verb. To bring into existence. Sometimes in particular smiley face. Felt. Noun. A cloth or stuff made of matted fibers of wool. Or wool and fur. Fold or rot into a compact substance by rolling in pressure. With lees or size. Without spinning or weaving. Verb. To make into felt. Or a felt-like substance. To cause to adhere and mat together. Branch. Noun. The woody part of a tree arising from the trunk and usually dividing. Verb. To arise from the trunk or a larger branch of a tree. Competing. Verb. To be in battle or in a rivalry with another for the same thing. Position. Or reward. To contend. Adjective. Being in the state of competition. Often unintentionally. Fixtures. Noun. Something that is fixed in place. Especially a permanent appliance or other item of personal property that is considered part of a house and is sold with it. Compare fitting. Furnishing. Carbon. Noun. The chemical element. Symbol C. With an atomic number of six. It can be found in pure form for example as graphite. A black. Shiny and very soft material. Or diamond. A colorless. Transparent. Crystalline solid and the hardest known material. Verb. To cause. Someone. To receive a carbon copy of an email message. Dentist. Noun. A medical doctor who specializes in dentistry. Enlightened. Verb. To supply with light. Noun. Someone who has been introduced to the mysteries of some activity. Religion especially Buddhism. Adjective. Educated or informed. Accounted. Verb. To provide explanation. Exile. Noun. The state of being banished from one's home or country. Verb. To send into exile. Bounds. Noun. Often used in plural. A boundary. The border which one must cross in order to enter or leave a territory. Verb. To surround a territory or other geographical entity. Noun. A sizable jump. Great leap. Verb. To leap. Move by jumping. Dialect. Noun. A variety of a language that is characteristic of a particular area. Community or social group. Differing from other varieties of the same language in relatively minor ways as regards grammar. Phonology. And lexicon. Arrange. Verb. To set up. To organize. To put into an orderly sequence or arrangement. Enthusiastic. Adjective. With zealous fervor. Excited. Motivated. Dollars. Noun. Official designation for currency in some parts of the world. Including Canada. The United States. Australia. New Zealand. Hong Kong. And elsewhere. Its symbol is dollar. Guy. Noun. An effigy of a man burned on a bonfire on the anniversary of the gunpowder plot. The 5th of November. Verb. To exhibit an effigy of Guy Fawkes around the 5th of November. Employees. Noun. An individual who provides labor to a company or another person. Day. Noun. Any period of 24 hours. Verb. To spend a day, in a place. Figure out. Verb. To come to understand. To discover or find a solution. To deduce. Adrenaline. Noun. Epinephrine. The hormone and neurotransmitter. Blink. Noun. The act of very quickly closing both eyes and opening them again. Verb. To close and reopen both eyes quickly. Determination. Noun. The act of determining, or the state of being determined. 
Fifth. Noun. The person or thing in the fifth position. Verb. To support something fifth. After four others have already done so. Adjective. The ordinal form of the number five. Mistakenly. Adverb. Wrongly. Erroneously. Flight. Noun. The act of flying. Verb. Of a spin bowler. To throw the ball in such a way that it has more airtime and more spin than usual. Adjective. Fast. Swift. Fleet. Foreign. Noun. A foreign person. Particularly. Adjective. Located outside a country or place. Especially one's own. Me. Pronoun. As the direct object of a verb. Euro. Noun. Person living or originating from Europe. Noun. The currency unit of the European Monetary Union. Symbol. Euro. Evolution. Noun. A change of position. Lifting. Verb. To raise or rise. Noun. The action or process by which something is lifted. Elevation. Apology. Noun. An expression of remorse or regret for having said or done something that harmed another. An instance of apologizing. Saying that one is sorry. Blame. Noun. Censure. Error. Noun. The substance constituting Earth's atmosphere. Particularly. Verb. To bring. Something. Into contact with the air. So as to freshen or dry it. Annual. Noun. An annual publication. A book. Periodical. Journal. Report. Comic book. Yearbook. Etc. Which is published serially once a year. Which may or may not be in addition to regular weekly or monthly publication. Adjective. Happening once every year. Challenging. Verb. To invite. Someone. To take part in a competition. Noun. The act of making a challenge. Adjective. Difficult. Hard to do. Indexing. Verb. To arrange an index for something. Especially a long text. Noun. A system used to assign indexes. Neglect. Noun. The act of neglecting. Verb. To fail to care for or attend to something. Across. Noun. Crosswords. Often in combination. A word that runs horizontally in the completed puzzle grid or its associated clue. Adverb. From one side to the other. Preposition. Two. Toward or from the far side of. Something that lies between two points of interest. Loaded. Verb. To put a load on or in. A means of conveyance or a place of storage. Adjective. Burdened by some heavy load. Packed. Necessity. Noun. The quality or state of being necessary, unavoidable, or absolutely requisite. Inputs. Noun. The act or process of putting in. Infusion. Verb. To put in. Put on. Calculation. Noun. The act or process of calculating. Jury. Noun. A group of individuals chosen from the general population to hear and decide a case in a court of. Law. Verb. To judge by means of a jury. Counting. Verb. To recite numbers in sequence. Noun. Account. Making. Noun. The act of forming, causing, or constituting. Workmanship. Construction. Maintain. Verb. To support. Someone. To back up or assist. Someone. In an action. Make for. Verb. To set out to go. Somewhere. To move towards. Ends. Noun. The terminal point of something in space or time. Verb. To come to an end. Noun. The area in close proximity to one's home. Neighborhood. Apartment. Noun. A complete domicile occupying only part of a building, especially one for rent. A flat. Advantages. Noun. Any condition. Circumstance. Opportunity or means. Particularly favorable to success. Or to any desired end. Verb. To provide. Someone. With an advantage. To give an edge to. Historian. Noun. A writer of history. A chronicler. An analyst. Dead. Noun. With the. A demonstrative. Or a possessive. Those who have died. Noun. Often with the. 
time when coldness, darkness, or stillness is most intense. Noun, usually plural, sterile mining waste, often present as many large rocks stacked inside the workings. Verb, to prevent by disabling, stop, adjective, no longer living, adverb, degree, exactly, chain, noun, a series of interconnected rings or links usually made of metal. Verb, to fasten something with a chain. Encryption. Noun. The process of obscuring information to make it unreadable without special knowledge. Key files. Or passwords. Adventure. Noun. The encountering of risks. A bold undertaking. In which dangers are likely to be encountered. And the issue is staked upon unforeseen events. A daring feat. Microphone. Noun. A device. Transducer. Used to convert sound waves into a varying electric current. Normally fed into an amplifier and either recorded or broadcast. Verb. To put one or more microphones on or in. Aisle. Noun. A wing of a building, notably in a church separated from the nave proper by piers. Major. Noun. A military rank between captain and lieutenant colonel. Adapter. Noun. One who is capable of adapting to differing situations. Abuse. Noun. Improper treatment or usage. Application to a wrong or bad purpose. An unjust. Corrupt or wrongful practice or custom. Gratitude. Noun. The state of being grateful. Extracted. Verb. To draw out, to pull out, to remove forcibly from a fixed position, as by traction or suction, etc. Fortunately. Adverb, in a fortunate manner. Mon. Noun, the former currency of Japan until 1870, before the yen. It. Noun, one who is neither a he nor a she. A creature. A dehumanized being. Adjective. Most fashionable. Pronoun. The third person singular personal pronoun that is normally used to refer to an inanimate object or abstract entity, also often used to refer to animals. All. Noun. With a possessive pronoun. Everything that one is capable of. Adjective. All gone. Dead. Adverb. Degree. Intensifier. Pronoun. Everything. Conjunction. Although. Healthier. Adjective. Enjoying health and vigor of body, mind, or spirit. Well. Grandparent. Verb. To be. Or act as. A grandfather to. Verb. To retain discontinued laws or rules for. A thing. Person or organization previously affected by them. Noun. The parent of someone's parent. Currency. Noun. Money or other items used to facilitate transactions. Juggler. Noun. Agent noun of juggle. One who either literally juggles objects. Or figuratively juggles tasks. Adenoids. Noun. One of two folds of lymphatic tissue covered by ciliated epithelium. They are found in the roof and posterior wall of the nasopharynx at the back of the throat behind. The uvula. They may obstruct normal breathing and make speech difficult when swollen. A condition often called adenitis. Manners. Noun. Mode of action. Way of performing or doing anything. Noun. Etiquette. Migration. Noun. An instance of moving to live in another place for a while. Excuse. Noun. Explanation designed to avoid or alleviate guilt or negative judgment. A plea offered in extenuation of a fault. Verb. To forgive. To pardon. Clubs. Noun. An association of members joining together for some common purpose. Especially sports or recreation. Verb. To hit with a club. Noun. One of the four suits of playing cards. Marked with the symbol club suit. Noun. A game in which questions are asked for the purpose of enabling the questioners to discover a word. Or thing previously selected by two persons who answer the questions. Monitoring. Verb. To watch over. To guard. Noun. The carrying out of surveillance on. Or continuous or regular observation of. 
an environment or people in order to detect signals, movements or changes of state or quality. Least. Noun. Something of the smallest possible extent. An indivisible unit. Adverb. Used for forming superlatives of adjectives. Especially those that do not form the superlative by adding est. Chew. Noun. The act of chewing. Mastication with the mouth. Verb. To crush with the teeth by repeated closing and opening of the jaws. Done to food to soften it and break it down by the action of saliva before it is swallowed. Closet. Noun. Any private area. Particularly. Bowers in the open air. Verb. To shut away for private discussion. Adjective. Private. Body. Noun. Physical frame. Verb. To give body or shape to something. Interests. Noun. The price paid for obtaining. Or price received for providing. Money or goods in a credit transaction. Calculated as a fraction of the amount or value of what was borrowed. Verb. To engage the attention of. To awaken interest in. To excite emotion or passion in. In behalf of a person or thing. Noun. The persons interested in any particular business or cause. Taken collectively. Festival. Noun. An event or community gathering. Usually staged by a local community. Which centers on some theme. Sometimes on some unique aspect of the community. Adjective. Pertaining to a feast or feast day. Now only as the noun used attributively. Hook. Noun. A rod bent into a curved shape. Typically with one end free and the other end secured to a rope or other attachment. Verb. To attach a hook to. Bowl. Noun. A roughly hemispherical container used to hold. Mix or present food. Such as salad. Fruit or soup. Or other items. Fitness. Noun. The condition of being fit, suitable or appropriate. Married. Noun. A married person. Adjective. In a state of marriage. Having a wife or a husband. Verb. To enter into the conjugal or connubial state. To take a husband or a wife. Connection. Noun. The act of connecting. Absence. Noun. A state of being away or withdrawn from a place or from companionship. The period of being away. Located. Verb. To place. To set in a particular spot or position. Batteries. Noun. A device used to power electric devices. Consisting of a set of electrically connected electrochemical or. Archaically. Electrostatic cells. A single such cell when used by itself. Call. Noun. A telephone conversation. Verb. Heading. To use one's voice. Ghost. Noun. The spirit. The soul of man. Verb. To haunt. To appear to in the form of an apparition. Counterexample. Noun. An exception to a proposed general rule. A specific instance of the falsity of a universally quantified statement. Adult. Noun. A fully grown human or animal. Verb. To. Cause to. Be or become an adult. Adjective. Fully grown. Broke. Verb. To separate into two or more pieces. To fracture or crack. By a process that cannot easily be reversed for reassembly. Adjective. Financially ruined. Bankrupt. Absence. Noun. A state of being away or withdrawn from a place or from companionship. The period of being away. Author. Noun. The originator or creator of a work. Especially of a literary composition. Verb. Sometimes proscribed. To create a work as its author. Enters. Noun. The enter key on a computer keyboard. Verb. To go or come into an enclosed or partially enclosed space. Maniac. Noun. An insane person, especially one who suffers from a mania. Defective. Noun. A person or thing considered to be defective. Adjective. Having one or more defects. Afford. Verb. To incur. Stand. Or bear without serious detriment. As an act which might under other circumstances be injurious. With an auxiliary. 
as can, could, might, etc., to be able or rich enough. Grandchildren. Noun, a child of someone's child. Formats. Noun, the layout of a publication or document. Verb, to create or edit the layout of a document. Collective. Noun, a farm owned by a collection of people. Adjective, formed by gathering or collecting. Gathered into a mass. Merchant. Noun. A person who traffics in commodities for profit. Verb. As a resident of a region. To buy goods from a non-resident and sell them to another non-resident. Immersed. Verb. To put under the surface of a liquid. To dunk. Adjective. Under the surface of a liquid. Sunk. Initiated. Verb. To begin. To start. Color. Noun. The spectral composition of visible light. Verb. To give something color. Adjective. Conveying color. As opposed to shades of gray. Freeway. Noun. A road designed for safe. High-speed operation of motor vehicles through the elimination of at-grade intersections. Usually divided and having at least two lanes in each direction. A dual carriageway with no at-grade crossings. A motorway. Honeymoon. Noun. The period of time immediately following a marriage. Verb. To have a honeymoon. A trip taken by a couple after wedding. Formatted. Verb. To create or edit the layout of a document. Adjective. That has been given a definite format. Manages. Verb. To direct or be in charge of. A noise. Noun. A feeling of discomfort or vexation caused by what one dislikes. Verb. To disturb or irritate, especially by continued or repeated acts. To bother with unpleasant deeds. Best-selling. Adjective. Highly popular with consumers purchasing goods within a specific class. Calendars. Noun. Any system by which time is divided into days, weeks, months, and years. Verb. To set a date for a proceeding in court. Usually done by a judge at a calendar call. Deduce. Verb. To reach a conclusion by applying rules of logic to given premises. Fallen. Verb. Heading. To be moved downwards. Noun. The dead. Adjective. Having dropped by the force of gravity. Invest. Verb. To spend money, time, or energy on something. Especially for some benefit or purpose. Used within. Mostly. Adverb. Mainly or chiefly. For the most part. Usually. Generally. On the whole. Disease. Noun. An abnormal condition of a human. Animal or plant that causes discomfort or dysfunction. Distinct from injury insofar as the latter is usually instantaneously acquired. Verb. To cause unease. To annoy. Irritate. Executes. Verb. To kill as punishment for capital crimes. Dice. Noun. Gaming with one or more dice. Verb. To play dice. Brave. Noun. A Native American warrior. Verb. To encounter with courage and fortitude. To defy. To provoke. Adjective. Strong in the face of fear. Courageous. Marketplace. Noun. An open area in a town housing a public market. Characterize. Verb. To depict someone or something a particular way, often negative. Books. Noun. A collection of sheets of paper bound together to hinge at one edge. Containing printed or written material. Pictures. Etc. Verb. To reserve. Something. For future use. Mastery. Noun. The position or authority of a master. Dominion. Command. Supremacy. Superiority. Executes. Verb. To kill as punishment for capital crimes. Method. Noun. A process by which a task is completed. A way of doing something. Followed by the adposition of. To or for before the purpose of the process. Verb. To apply a method. Fix. Noun. A repair or corrective action. Verb. To pierce. Now generally replaced by transfix. Crowd. Noun. 
a group of people congregated or collected into a close body without order. Verb. To press forward. To advance by pushing. Exclude. Verb. To bar. Someone. From entering. To keep out. Jogging. Noun. The action of the verb to jog. Adopt. Verb. To take by choice into relationship. A child. Heir. Friend. Citizen. Etc. Meet. Noun. A sports competition. Especially for track and field. A track meet. Or swimming. A swim meet. Verb. To make contact. With. While in proximity.